What's up, YouTubers? This is Joe, and uh, today I'll be doing my very first ever video unboxing of the uh, WL Toys K939 Stadium truck. I believe this would be the first one in uh, North America. I've uh, looked at YouTube and I can't find one, uh, but finally, finally, after about, I'd say, seven or eight months of trying to get my hands on one, <clears throat> I finally found a seller that was able to ship it all the way here to Canada. I've been having some issues with a lot of the sellers. They claim that they shipped it. Um, they made an excuse. It came back. Apparently, there must be some sort of postage issue with them. It can't be past a certain size. Some sellers don't even ship one-tenth anymore. But anyway, this uh, is a larger one-tenth, as you'll soon see. Um, so anyways, without further ado, again, the very first... Um, video unboxing in North America for the W Toys K939. So I have it right here. As you can see, it's in a huge box. All right. So I'm gonna start and unboxing this thing for you guys. So let's see here. Wow, this thing's huge. Said it took about two months for me to get um, my hands on this one here. I don't know, I guess it took the slow boat from China or something, I'm not sure. But finally, finally, after all this time, I finally have one. Alright, looks like we're upside down. Slide out of the box. All right. So, as you can see, the box is quite big, but it says here race 4x4, four four, uh, streamlined design, excellent configuration, follow me, feeling really activity, follow me, feeling really activity. I don't know, this chinglish is kind of funny sometimes, but anyway, uh, it's what's inside that comes, right? So basically, as you can see, here's uh, one body that they offer. It's the blue and uh, gray one. It's really nice, actually. And uh, it says it goes 50 kilometers an hour, but we'll see about that. At top of the box, it's quite large, actually. It's uh, WL Toys K939, ready to run, pro, uh, 50 kilometers an hour. It's got dual 550 uh, brushed motors, um, high strength, lightweight aluminum drive tube, machine steel gears, high precision ball bearings, high rate lithium battery, and all alloy uh, gearbox. So that's the orange model uh, that they have here. Uh, the side. Nothing really out of the ordinary. That's the other side of the box. And of course, we got that side here too. Anyway, guess you can read all that later. So now for the fun stuff. I'm gonna take it out of the box. Let's see what's happening here. All right. I chose the orange model to get this out of the way. First off, typical instruction manual. Uh, this looks like it's some sort of extra motor mount or something. The tool to remove your tires. They're all pretty much standard WL Toys um, books. You've seen them already. I won't bother going through them. And here is the truck. Wow, this thing is huge. Damn, I gotta take this whole box apart. Let's see. So, I'm guessing this will be the transmitter. Let's see. So. You 
Yeah, it's a typical WL Toys uh, transmitter. You can take everything out of here. Alright, so there's your transmitter. Uh, typical, it's got your uh, throttle trim, steering trim. You can adjust that as you see fit. Adjustable antenna. Left and right, the normal. Pretty basic, but it works. And then we have... Looks like the regular charger. Okay, it looks like this is just a regular charger. You've seen these with the 2S balance port, which I won't be using 2S, so I'll use one of my hobby grade chargers to uh, charge up the battery. Euro plug with uh, you can put an adapter at the end of it, but I don't even use these, so I'm not really too worried about it. Get rid of this. Get rid of the remote. What else? That's it. Okay. So, see because the box is quite big, take it all apart. First time ever unboxing in North America. So this is a, definitely a first. Taking everything out of the box. I ordered the orange K959. And here it is. Finally, after all these months. So, um, let's take everything apart here because I know you guys want to see what's inside. Take out the regular body clips. These are, I guess, one tenth scale body clips. All right. So, as anticipated, we have our two 550 brush motors. I believe this is a, that's a 2S battery, which I won't be using, but let's take it out, you guys can see. Just a generic battery, it's a, yeah, 4,000 milliamp, 7.4 volt, so just a 2S battery. You have your, looks like it's a dual bank brushed ESC, Dean's connector, big bore shocks, I gotta take this off here, yeah, yeah there's definitely oil in them so that's a good thing. Let's see, we have purple anodized finished under the uh, near the heat sink here in the fan the heat sink for the motors got some uh, aluminum bits here for strength that connect the rear suspension together so that's a good thing as mentioned steel uh, gearbox so that's a good thing um, yeah it looks like okay, these are CVDs but quite thick There's no dog bones to be spoken of but these things are huge they're quite thick you can see a little closer see that all right same in the back yeah. looks like the diff is nice it's rotating very smoothly so no complaints there underneath You can see the anodized purple drive shaft. This thing's got to be looks about six six mils. This thing's huge. An exposed uh, servo. So yeah, it looks like it's pretty adequate protection. Really, yeah, it's pretty good actually. 
So yeah, so that's basically the inside of the truck. The body shell, quite large as you can see. That nice bright purple so it will really stand out. Yeah, it's really nice. Let's put everything back together here. about it so I'll be doing another review like I normally do of uh, sorry video I should say of um, the K939 out on the road I'll do my best to try to hit a track I know it's uh, it's approaching November now so it's gonna be harder to find one but I'll definitely uh, do a video like I normally do of various uh, RC's that I have and I'm very happy to uh, show you guys so uh, I guess that's about it for the, my video unboxing of the W O Toys K939, I would say stadium truck, I'd say. And that's about it. So if uh, you have any questions, please leave your comments below. And I'll be happy to answer any of your questions or concerns that you have. And uh, yeah, I look forward to the uh, driving review of this thing for sure. Alright, take care guys.